So to begin with, I had an image of a sea anemone that I took at the ocean and I brightened the colors. And then I decided to hone in and crop a certain area of it, enlarge it into something that looked more like an abstract composition, but based on this um, underwater scene which is absolutely beautiful and inspiring. And that's how I created, started to create this piece. I recreated the image with jelly print papers so and then I, I was starting here, to use paint um, over it. To imitate what I'm trying to do is I mix this Thalo Turquoise Nova Color with some matte acrylic extender as well as um, the acrylic flow release by Golden. And what that does is it creates a more um, flowing medium that I'm gonna use on top of my color. So what I want to try and get effect of this um, shape over here, which is actually a close up of a sea urchin and I'm going to see if I can use my acrylic flow paint in a way that'll kind of give this feeling. I'm not trying to imitate it exactly. I'm trying to just give the feeling of this flow. So here goes. I experiment. I don't know how it's going to turn out, but um, it's going to be fun. That I know. So I'm just going to pour a little bit on here over this color and I'm going to see what happens if I blow Oh, I like that already um, Let's see, maybe I can let some of it run in this way, see what happens. I don't have total control, but I'm just trying to get inspired by the piece that I did. And I may even get some paper to blot some of this back so you can see the underlayer is showing really nicely and you're getting that more translucent quality that you would get if you were peering through the ocean and seeing the sea urchin underneath and so I'm going to just um, sit with this for now and next time I'll show you how I'm going to continue, but I like the start of this. Mm -hmm. 